Hello, my name is John Brinzo. Uh, I'm a member of the Young Americans for Liberty. Um, I'm currently working on getting um, the De Anza chapter recognized um, with uh, a number of other uh, quote-unquote liberty warriors. Um, and um, yeah, I'm making this video because recently um, us uh, liberty warriors, we sat down, us liberty warriors from De Anza, we sat down with... Um, with uh, the California uh, candidate for governor Nicholas Wildstar, and um, yeah, it was um, it was really cool. Um, you know, it's not every day that you get to uh, dine with a uh, California governor, um, but you know, um, he was really down to earth, uh, Nicholas Wildstar, and um, I think that uh, I really think that. Um, he has what it takes, you know. He has what it takes to. Uh, he has what it takes to uh, be governor, you know. Um, and I don't want to get into uh, the other candidates necessarily, but um, what I what, what I can speak on is Nicholas Wildstar. So, you know, and I'll preface this by saying no one's perfect. No, not me, not anyone. You know, no one's perfect. Um, that said. It seems like Nicholas Wildstar is the only person who's trying to chase perfection, right? So Vince Lombardi had this quote one time, uh, well, not one time, but it's kind of, it's, um, it's a popular quote. And uh, the, what, the, the quote that I'm referencing is that perfection is not attainable, right? It's impossible to be perfect. But in the pursuit of perfection, while trying to be perfect, we can gain excellence, right? So, and I think that Nicholas Wildstar, he's the person who's, he's, he's thinking big. He's a person that wants to get California, you know, California, it has the highest GDP uh, of the state. It's the highest, it's the state with the highest G GDP in the country. It's, you know, we have Silicon Valley. We have so much culture in Cal in California, right? And uh, I think that Nicholas Wildstar wants to just make California better. And because of that, um, you know, and like I said, having been able to sit down with him, he's very down to earth. And um, he's someone who I believe can, you know, he can really, he can lead California the way that California has needed a leader. And, um, and well, you know, um, I don't mean to, uh, you know, J Jerry Brown, you know, thank you for your service. And all that you've done for uh, California, but uh, I think it's time for someone new, and I think that person is uh, Nicholas Wildstar. So, you know, we'll we'll see what happens. Hopefully, y'all will support him. Um, I think that he is the best candidate out there, um, and he's liberty minded. He wants to take care of your freedoms. He wants to respect all parties. You know. He's not catering to one segment of the population or maybe not even a minority of the population, but something you see nowadays is someone who just caters to the majority of the population, right? Well, Nicholas Wildstar, he wants to make California better for everyone, right? So that's my piece about Nicholas Wildstar. Nicholas, it was great having dinner with you and uh, keep it up, man. Thank you for fighting the good fight for... Uh, for liberty in America and specifically in California. And once again, vote Nicholas Wildstar.